It's all five starters out for Bryant so far. Kiki Palmer, the senior, awaits substitution. Ashley up strong, and that one's good. It looked like it was... Sixth man off the bench this year, so have her out there to run the show and try to get this team out in transition and get some more points. Palmer, Scanlon, the long two. That one's good. You don't see that every day, Hannah Scanlon. I'd say they haven't hit one yet, and Haynes finally gets one to fall. But overall, it's been the Sacred Heart guards going to the hoop that's been the issue for the Bulldogs. One for eight as Holloway up and in. One for eight. It is Davis with this one. Last year, of course, knocking off the Bulldogs 80 to 63 in the NEC tournament. Ashley, the contested two, rattles around and drops. There, it's 36 to 21. Starting to spiral out of hand for the Bulldogs now. This is definitely cause for concern. Scanlon was wide open and that one's good. She had a great ball move to yeah. get off the defender. Tati LaFrance Boyce goes two for two from the line. Shot clock is off. 10 seconds left. Murphy will huck up a three. Good, she put a little extra mustard into that one. It's Zegarowski. Here's a steal from Haygood. She's on a breakaway. Let's see if Scanlon can catch her. Oh. Swats it away. O is right from Devin Murray. Look at that. Haynes looking for help. Connors to Zegarowski to Ashley. Ashley, the mid-range jumper. That one's good. Big shot by Ashley. She's playing very hard to Sacred Hearts 9. 28 paint points for Sacred Heart as well. 16 for Bryant. The long three. That one's good. And contested. Oh, my goodness. Hey, good. For the night. Holloway ranked nationally in offensive rebounds per game. Palmer, the three. No good. And it'll be Sacred Heart ball. Up is Haygood, just barely gets in. It's been the type of game it is. Bryant got four chance compete. Kellner with the rebound here. Look at this crew on the court right now. It's Megan Bianchi, Julia Kellner, Steph Lesko, Tati LaFrance Boyce, and Sydney Holloway. And look something that Coach Burke's gonna remember. That you come in down by 19, 20 points and you keep fighting. How about keeping a dribble on the ground? Was that not incredible or what? Here's LaFrance Boyce ah. from three. What a sequence. Oh, my goodness. So seven. The crew out there still is Bravo, Kellner, Lesko, Tati LaFrance Boyce, and Megan Bianchi. Bravo up. That one is drained from Trinity Bravo. How about that finish with the defender all over her? She could have very well gotten the end one there with a blocking foul. But regardless, a great finish. Bryant leads 5-4 in the quarter. Up strong. And down it goes for Sacred. Here's Kat Haynes against Kellner. Kellner, a nice job to stop that one. Here's Megan Bianchi. Pops up from the stripe. That one's good. I love Bianchi's shot there. She's only attempted two, but just a beautiful little mid. She will coach her 1,000th game relatively soon. It's on the horizon for her. Great to have that type of stability at the top for a program. They've had so many good teams over the years. And Has really just talked about how it's a matter of settling in, learning the system, and understanding the pace that Division I basketball is played right. at. And it's only a matter of Because it is a faster pace. It just seems like everything's moving quicker. Well, Bryant coming alive here the in the last 15 seconds.